Alright guys, this is my 8-bit calculator and today I've got something new to show you. As well as it being able to add, which you should have seen in the last video, I've also given it the capability to subtract numbers with this extension here. It looks a bit complicated with all of these red uh, information buses coming out from this section here, but this section just consists of 16 transistors which add act to invert the B input because in order to gain the subtraction functionality all you need to do is simply invert any of the inputs A or B in this case I've chosen to invert B and make the first carry in high basically in order to create a let's say well first of all let, let's say let, let's look at the number 2 in binary 1 0 right in order to make minus 2 in binary you need to invert the ones and zeros and add 1 to the binary value obviously with my B input I'm trying to make it into a minus whatever numerical value I choose so let's say I choose my I, I want to minus 2 basically I just invert the the, the inputs and I make carry in for the lowest significant bit high or least significant bit that's what I meant to say see over here right now it's in minus mode so the least significant bit is high the carry in so um well I'm gonna turn off all the inputs first and put this calculator in addition mode and then I'm gonna set some inputs and the calculator will calculate the 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 values of the inputs I insert. It takes a bit of time for the calculator to calibrate. Oops, I forgot this input. It should turn off. There you go. So um let's say I want to do three one one add one zero one. So three add one is four. Let's give this time to calculate. There you go, four. So let's say I wanted to do three minus one. Well, that would equal 2, wouldn't it? Lots of flashing things. There you go, 2. So, this calculator can add and subtract numerical values. The next stage is to extend this calculator to give it the functionalities of multiplication and division which I'm working on at the moment hopefully it'll be easier than addition and subtraction just have to see won't we 